This workflow video will demonstrate how workspaces can be used to coordinate the flow of trades in Synchro. As you can see, I've set up different resource appearance profiles for each trade so that it's easier to visualize the flow of trades throughout the project. Then I can start assigning the workspaces to their tasks, making sure that I have the correct resource appearance profile selected. Using this method, I can assign the same location resource or workspace to different tasks and then simply look at the color to identify which trade is occupying the workspace at any point in time. We can move the focus time and look at the 3D view to try to spot overlapping workspaces, or we can use the Synchro Spatial Coordination tool. Select the location resources you want to include in your spatial coordination test and go to Navigator Spatial Coordination. Add a new test. Make sure that you run the test on the selected 3D objects only so that the number of detected clashes is reduced to just what we're focusing on. And right click run the test. Even though it's the same workspace being used by two trades at the same time, Synchro will detect this as a clash and will indicate the clash start, clash finish, the two tasks that are involved as well as the clash duration. We can avoid this conflict by delaying the start of one of the non-critical activities. And then clicking on reschedule so that the schedule updates. Just by playing the animation, we can see that the conflict is removed. We can run the test again to make sure that this is true. Click on Restore 3D Selection to restore what was selected in the last test run, and right-click Run the Test. If your coordination was successful, there shouldn't be any more clashes.